Hello and welcome back to the channel. Now today we're going to be going through the new festive update that is going to be released next Thursday for next month's Horizon uh, Festival playlist. So there will be four weeks of festival themed events and on top of that there is a bunch of new cars that have been added in and later on we're going to go over the brand new set of accolades that have also been included in the game. So without further ado let's go and get stuck in and take a look at what events we're going to be seeing and also some of the new cars that are going to be added as well as prizes now at the start the main overall rewards there you get a gingerbread outfit for 120 points which i'm sure everyone's buzzing about but then you can get the lamborghini aventador svj for 200 points which is very cool also you can see there a horizon secret santa so in order to unlock a santa outfit and a car that is not yet noted uh, you'll have to send gifts uh, via the gift drop to other players and then once globally everyone has sent a certain number of cars to each other we'll be able to unlock the santa outfit and an unknown car now moving on to the summer wet season festival playlist you'll be able to unlock the Mercedes AMG E63 and the Maserati 8CTF. Now, neither of those are new cars, but when you go into this festival playlist, you'll see holiday themed events like the trial is the elf on the shelf and there's some snowman themed ones later on. Also, you can unlock a Ford Mustang 1969 and a number 14 Ford Fiesta rally car, uh, which is pretty cool, but none of them are brand new. On top of that, there's a few more sort of holiday themed events. Now moving on to the autumn season, so the overall season progress you can win the Konenzeg 1 and the Exolot OR Forza edition which is pretty cool but again neither of them are brand new. Then further in you can win a snowman outfit which is obviously very holiday themed. But if you look further down into the seasonal championship, you can win the new Lamborghini Aventador J which is being added as a new car but has of course featured in Forza Horizon 4 previously. Then you can see on the far right there's a collectible challenge which is to do with snowmen, so I imagine you have to smash a certain amount of them. Now moving on to the winter season, one of the prizes you can win is the Ferrari 599 GTO, which again is another brand new car that is being added into the game, but has of course featured in previous ones, and you can win the Mayer's Manx Forza Edition as well. On top of that there are of course more themed challenges that are to do with the holiday season and you can win a Hoonigan Escort and a Toyota race suit as well through one of the seasonal championship events and of course more themed events. Now for the final season, the spring season, both of the cars available here are brand new. So you've got the Lamborghini Gallardo Spider, which will have a convertible working roof and of course has featured in Horizon 4 and Peel is returning. So you can win the Peel Trident and on top of that, the Peel P50 will be added into the game as well. Then through some more themed events, you can win other cars and wheel spins. But then on the last seasonal championship there, you can win another car that is being added in, which is the Ferrari 575M, which is pretty cool. And then some more uh, themed challenges and a photo challenge guide that wants you to use the Peel Trident uh, to complete it. So you'll have to progress quite far into that season in order to complete the photo challenge so there you saw a bunch of new cars in the week or season two's festival playlist which is all based around christmas and new years as you can see though not all of the new cars are shown on those challenges so some of them will probably be purchasable in the forzathon shop potentially some are will spin only and some will obviously be purchasable maybe only for people with the sort of car pass pack i'm not entirely sure on that but some of the new ones can be won in challenges and i'm sure that another new one will be that sort of secret santa prize as well now we're going to move on to the new accolades which they do actually reveal quite a lot that's going to be added into the game for the festive season so once you should go over to your accolades tab it's already there it's called evolving world and there are 13 new accolades all holiday themed of course so the first one happy holidays basically just wants you to visit this stadium and there is going to be an ice rink there which is pretty cool so that's a new feature the next one wants you to discover the Horizon Wonderland in Mulige, which I imagine is just going to be all decorated very Christmassy, nevertheless very cool. Then there's also going to be a giant Christmas tree in Guanajuato, which is very very cool as well. 
And then you want to, <laughs> for the next one, earn some drift skills in the ice rink to unlearn, unlock 50 accolade points and five air skills in the stadium as well. On top of that, it wants you to earn 5,000 score in any of the newly added peels at the ice rink to get the uh, Pelive in yourself accolade. And it wants you to smash 25 candy canes, so they're obviously going to be littered around the map in certain places there. Also, there are going to be Christmas trees added by the looks of it because it wants you to smash 25 of those. And on top of that, if you go the extra mile and smash 25 snowmen and Christmas trees and candy canes in a Mazda, you will unlock a horn of the Silent Night hymn. Now there's a Series 2 Collector Challenge which wants you to own the 2019 Lamborghini Aventador SVJ, the 2012 Lamborghini Aventador J, 2012 Gallardo LP570-4 Spider Performante, the 2011 Ferrari 599 GTO, 2002 Ferrari 575M, the 1939 Maserati 8 CTF, 1962 Peel P50 and the 65 Peel Trident. So they will all be added into this season's events. The next one wants you to visit Guanajuato during the new year to see the beautiful lanterns. Now, whether this is something that will happen sort of after the clock strikes 12 on December the 31st, I don't know. Or if you'll just be able to unlock it in that week uh, of events at that time. Also, in the new year, it wants you to smash 25 lanterns in a Toyota AT38 or the 2016 Toyota AT37, which, for those of you who don't know, are the big uh, sort of uh, Hilux trucks. So they're obviously being added back in again, although they were uh, featured previously in Horizon 4. And then the Series 3 Collector one that probably just wants you to have completed all of those challenges um, or maybe that will relate to Series 3 once this season is over. But anyway, nevertheless, they are very cool. And like I said, there are being some new cars added in with these sort of accolades, which will let you know, and the festival playlist. So I do think it's going to be quite a fun festive themed season. But I want to know what you think as well. What are you most looking forward to out of the new cars and new challenges? Let me know down below in the comments. Anyway, folks, I hope that you enjoyed this video. I would massively appreciate if you could drop a like if you did and subscribing to the channel massively helps me out, especially as we're so close to 10k, which is absolutely fantastic. I cannot tell you how happy I am about almost hitting 10,000 subs. Anyway, folks, I want to wish you all the best. Make sure you stay safe and take care.